road has many rules. Follow traffic signals. Don't let the vehicle idle for too long. Watch where you park. Rich Mint is on the lookout. Yeah. I'd rather have the police uh, doing this sort of thing, but uh, there's such a volume of uh, parking and uh, idling and so forth offenses in the city that uh, it's, I think, helpful if we can uh, informally deputize people who are concerned about it to be part of the enforcement mechanism. The NYC Taxi and Limousine Commission has a program that allows people to report drivers of livery cars and cabs, snap a picture, submit to the city's 311 info system, and it's investigated. The driver can receive a summons. The fine is not shared with the citizen in this case. If they can change their behavior, especially in Manhattan, it has a significant impact on safety in the city. We want to empower citizens, empower New Yorkers to hold people accountable. Councilmember Lincoln Ressler has proposed expanding the citizen reports. His bill, recently introduced to council, would pay a portion of the fine back to the person submitting documentation over placard abuse or parking. The idling program at DP has been a tremendous success. It's modeled after a city program created in 2019. People can get 25% of the fine for reporting buses and trucks that sit and idle for more than three minutes. A continuous video with engine sound has to be submitted online after creating an account. In 2021, citizens sent in more than 12,000 submissions, generating 2.3 million in fines. That's 724,000 paid to citizen reporters. Jeff Novich got and, some. And I actually personally filed a few um, idling complaints. I got paid for one. It's probably a lot that needs to be done to, to be able to mail a summons to the driver's address based solely on the license plate. The city uh, probably will have to work through some uh, legal uh, implications. They're having that discussion. Councilmember Ressler uh, is trying to get some additional sponsors. Uh, this still needs uh, to have a hearing about the possible expansion. Uh, the program right now for the idling uh, report, uh, that does involve an investigation process. Uh, the city does uh, see that through. In Midtown, Greg Mocker, PIX11 News.